How much does it cost to replace your battery? This has to be the most asked question I get as an EV owner. The quick answer, nothing at all. It will be replaced totally free of charge. Hi, I'm Dave. Welcome to Dave Takes It On. Please subscribe if you like this video. It makes such a difference. Internal combustion engine cars typically have a two or three year warranty. Subject to mileage restrictions of about 25, 30,000 miles, they require the car is serviced and even then have a very long list of parts that are excluded due to fair wear and tear. Electric vehicles are very complex electronically, but relatively simple mechanically. They have a much simpler warranty, typically three or four years on the whole car, restricted to around 50 or 60,000 miles with no servicing requirement and covering repair or replacement of any parts manufactured or supplied, which fail under normal use and a further eight years and up to 150,000 mile on the battery and powertrain. And that includes the electric motor, the gearbox, the inverter, the battery management system and battery heating and cooling. Yes, EVs have a gearbox, but it's a fixed single speed reduction box to allow the motor to operate at its optimum speed and torque. So how does that make the battery replacement free? Average mileage for a UK driver is 8,000, so the average UK car at 7 years old, have it covered at around 60,000 mile, is still totally within its original manufacturer's warranty. In the US to drive further, their average mileage is 13,000 mile, so 7 years old for them is 91,000 miles, still well within warranty. AV batteries are actually remarkably reliable and long-lived. There are tales of cars doing over a million miles on the original battery, but these are rare. Most will happily reach about 200,000 miles before reaching a point where you may need to think about it needing to be replaced. In the UK, that's 25 years of motoring in the same car. So how likely are you still to be driving your EV at 8 years old when the battery warranty expires? Well, very, very unlikely is the quick answer. The average age of a car on our roads is eight years. Most are scrapped by 13 years old. So the idea that there are thousands or tens of thousands of drivers who keep their car 25 years and will have to pay to replace their battery is clearly ludicrous. Just 2% of drivers change the cars every single year, 4% change every two years. About half of all drivers will have changed their car by the time it's four years old. By six years old, almost every single driver has changed his car. And this doesn't apply only to new cars. The same retention applies if we buy a low mileage used car. Almost half will have sold it within four years and nearly all before they've had it six years. Now, obviously there will be exceptions. The old man who's had his car from new in the 60s and still potters to the shops in it. But by far and away, the vast majority of drivers do not keep any car longer than six years. Or to put it another way, even buying a used EV, the average motorist in the UK will never need to replace the battery at all and will almost certainly not need to pay a penny towards replacing it if it does fail. Well, thanks for watching. If you like this video, please subscribe and hit the like button. It makes such a difference to a new start YouTube channel like ours.